We need something now. This is an emergency. This is a crisis situation. Stanislaus County officials are working to solve what they are calling a homeless crisis. It's an emergency. We have an emergency. This is like the fires up north, and we're going to we're trying to respond in that way to, to get something up that can start something immediately. County officials who make up the group called Focus on Prevention are hoping to use the county's former scenic general hospital as an emergency temporary shelter over the next three years. We have this building sitting empty. We need a place to get these individuals. We've got people out there working with them. Open for pets, partners and possessions. It's meant to serve as a 24 hour treatment center. It has room for 60 beds in these combined two wings of the former hospital. And the, and the hope is they'll come in here. We'll hopefully get them to a point where we can get them into temporary to transitional housing. They'll move out here into, into that kind of housing, hopefully working their ways back into our society again to be successful and we'll bring in additional individuals. But not everyone is on board. Well, I'm really upset about um, they're going to put it right next to my house and they didn't tell me anything about it. Sue Adams has lived here for 22 years and she's worried this shelter will inevitably attract more transients into her neighborhood. We've had a lot of things stolen by the homeless people. We already have several homeless people living in the park. They bring tons of trash. Uh, they dump trash on the street. They've stolen things from us. Uh, they broke into our garage. But others understand they might not have anywhere else to go. We had them sleeping in the alley. You know, so yeah, get them out of the alley. Get them someplace to stay. In Modesto, Lena Howland, ABC 10 News.